Casper, first of all, welcome to Vail Park. Uh, you've made a deadline day loan move to the club. Uh, you'll be with the club for the remainder of the season. Talk us through the last couple of days from your perspective. Um, yeah, hectic, uh, exciting as well. Um, but yeah, very happy to be here. And obviously, touch it has been a hectic couple of days for you, and I'm sure there's been so many things going on the last last couple of days. But what is it about when you got that call that Port Vale are interested? What is it that piqued your interest and thought that's where I want to go? I think I think it's a great club, um, and for me, it's somewhere where I think I could develop. Uh, obviously, in the short space of time, obviously the gaffer was a centre half as well, which is which is always a bonus, um, and it's somewhere where I think I'll get game time, which is important. And obviously it is your first day at the club, a lot's gone on today. Uh, you've been at the club for a couple of hours now, you've had the chance to meet Andy Crosby, Dave Flipcroft, the backroom staff and a, a number of players whilst you've been here. What have your first impressions been of the, the, the Vale Park, the, the players, the staff, what, what's, what have been your impression? Yeah, I mean, I was surprised when I come in and I think the facilities and um, just the stadium itself and every, you know, details behind it, I think, you know, top notch. Um, the boys, you know, I've, I've met a couple of them and, they're, you know, they're ledge and, and uh, embrace me. Um, spoke to the gaffer briefly. Uh, he's really nice. I spoke to him a couple of times already. So, yeah. And you touched on learning from the gaffer as, as a former centre half himself. And obviously coming to a squad with some experienced players, you look at Nathan Smith, who's got more than 300 appearances to a name, even though it's still such a young age himself. Uh, players like Fonzo Ojo, uh, Alex Jakovetti. How are you hoping to learn from them and take bits and bobs from their game to put to mould yourself? Yeah, I mean, even though I'm here to to compete and play and uh, and win games for Port Vale, obviously I want to be in that starting level. But also, you know, I want to learn off these guys. You know, that maybe have a bit more experience and 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 have had a better career than me so far. Um, you know, um, I don't think you should ever stop learning. And you know. I'm, I'm 22. I've got a long way to go, and um, yeah, just pick pick things up. You know how they behave, how they train, uh, what they do, and how they treat everyone else. You know, and these are the little things you try to pick up from from the experienced ones. Um, so yeah, I'll definitely be looking to do that. And obviously, when that time does come for you to make your debut in front of the Vale fans, what can they come to expect from you as a player on the field? You know, I think with me, what you see is what you get. Um, dominating strikers physically and in the air, like commanding the box, uh, squeezing the lineup. I think organising. Uh, I'd say I'm an old school defender and you know there's no shame in saying that. Um, I love defending and I love winning and that's the most important thing for me. Casper, welcome to Vale Park. Thank you very much.